Welcome, Lakeland Community College, to Brando's Brain Drain. I'm your host, DJ Brando. And I am Walrus. Uh, formerly uh, DJ Bicycle Bicycle, but uh, we don't really care about much of our nicknames here, considering uh, most of our nicknames get lost in the void. That's 221 since our show has started. Yes. We have been on a roll, but we have no one to mark it down, so we are going to... Uh, we're going to improvise, and we're well, going to get... that's because Raptor's temporarily in the void. It's 222. <laughs> Gosh darn it, man. So what do we got? So I at, could just do it for now. No, we're at 222. All right. So uh, we're good there. Void. Okay, 223. We're on a roll. So uh, before we start our show, we want to thank our sponsors. Uh, none of you, actually, because we have no sponsors, because we suck. Where are our robot parts? Uh, yes, our robot parts. Um, as, as per all of our broadcasting every week, we always ask for uh, a generous donation of robot parts for our conquest to take over the world. If any of you have robot parts and or copious amounts of Aquaphor, uh, we will accept that because uh, one of us has gotten some new flesh art and he needs to heal because he burns in the void. 224. So, uh, very unseasonably warm. Walrus for this fall season, wouldn't you yeah, say? Yeah, where's the fall? I'm not sure where the fall is. I think it's kind of fallen into the void. Oh, of goodness. Course. There we go, 225. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm getting a word from our the gods on the other side. I feel like there is a presence getting warped in here. Hey, what do you think having me come in here? Raptor, you finally showed up. Where were you? Where was I? Oh, well, that's quite easy. I was... Wait, this isn't easy. What am I talking about? I was in the void, trying to find my way, but as you know, there's no up, there's no down, there's no left, no right. There's no nothing. No wrong either. (laughs) There is only void. There is only void. So, (laughs) it took me a while, but eventually I managed to create a device that would Bring me back here, at least for a little while. What'd you make it out of? Void bits? <laughs> void bits, void metal, void crystal. And, uh, void void? No. Uh, you know what? That's just two more voids. Right? Dang it, that's three more <laughs> we're adding on there. So we already got 13, and we haven't even been on air for three minutes. Great job, guys. We are on a roll. So we win. Before we get more concentrated onto uh, the void... Uh, we have a topic for today. Um, before you came in, DJ Raptor, uh, we were discussing how unseasonably warm it is for the fall season. Oh, certainly. I am not digging this at all. When it should be spooky season and Mr. Bone Jangle should be coming out of his little uh, home in the ground, here we are suffering with summer-like weather. I know. What the heck? Where is the Great Pumpkin? I thought he was supposed to come out. The Great Pumpkin is currently sweating his rear end off in the middle of a field somewhere, and he's just said F it to the entire thing, so he is going to do his own thing for a while in his own little dimension. <laughs> you know what? That sounds a lot like the Void. <sighs> you know what? I, Walrus, I knew you were going to bring up the Void once again. Oh, dang, I did too. What? Did, what? Okay, for real, all of two of you listening out here, we really don't even know what this show is anymore, so we're just going to wing it from now on. Here on Brando's Brain Drain, a.k.a. The Void Hour. <laughs> we're going to make it up to 365 today, and uh, 365, probably 370 when we're done with it, because we have absolutely no content. But anyways, with spooky season... We're devoid of content. That doesn't count. <laughs> that's, that's devoid, not void. Uh, that counts. <laughs> this is too easy. This it's is- all about the void. I don't know why I agreed with this on you, but seeing as I'm in this dimension for the next few months, I guess uh, we're just going to have to wing it. So anyways, spooky season. Uh, Halloween. Halloween. Halloween is definitely coming up, and I am I personally am uh, very, very excited for that. How are you boys feeling about this? I am I am super feeling excited. spooky. So, also, I hear that um, the spooky season weather will be with us tomorrow yes it will it'll be about a high of 65 tomorrow which is great for all of us who are working outside and even better for the people who can't stand the heat in the first place i know i can't i've got so much internal uh, i've got natural insulation so it all stays inside all of that heat personally i do not know of the natural not anymore at least i don't know of the natural insulation thingy madu going on but i definitely do with the tattoos covering a majority of my arms, it's uh, it's very uh, it's 
very difficult to be out in the heat because you heat up very quickly. Also, hair. Hair is very... Hair is a curse, but we suffer for our art, as we discussed uh, a few weeks ago on our (laughs) show here. True, true. Art is always suffering, but then again. But, I mean, we're in suffering season right now for Halloween. Speaking of which, uh... Now, for all of you who don't know, Lakeland does have a Halloween party coming up. The date will be is still to be announced. No, it's 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 announced. It's I think it's the last Thursday in October or something. Looks like I've been swimming in the void too long. I'm sure there are places we could look it up if we want to get the specific oh, yeah. details. We've got a computer right we here. We do have uh, modern technology here at Brando's Brain Drain. Uh, last year, all we had were a potatoes, a couple of... Uh, a uh, couple bits of string, a squirrel, and a megaphone. It was no fun. It was no fun at all. The squirrel wasn't fun? The squirrel was not fun. He was rather mean. Oh, damn. I did not like Mr. Squirrel, man. He was no fun. And Halloween party. Also, a reminder, again, robot parts. Robot parts. We need our robot parts. Yeah, we're still laughing. And when we're done, we will have a robot part T. Oh, Yeah. Oh, this is 2015. Doesn't look like uh, it's been announced here on Bookface. It's yeah, it's um, well. So yeah, let's just I could just pop out and find out when it is. Yeah, yeah. I think think your uh, the um, what what, what was his title again? Uh, who? Um, Overlord and Savior. Here we go, Overlord and Savior. Yeah. Well. I will return very shortly. It seems like he, um, uh, Walrus is getting lost to the void, so we are going to wait for him. That's already 20, 21 voids, now that I said it again. So we are up to 241. Lost still... to the void or lost in the sauce? Uh, you see, your loss is my sauce, so I'll take what I can get here. Void sauce? Uh, yes, void sauce. That's two more. Gosh darn it. <laughs> and he's already back from the void. 25, 25, we are at 247 voids, 248. Walrus, did you get the information? Get the information. What's up? I am back from the information void. Welcome. And, yes, the Halloween party is on the 26th of October. A little bit earlier, but um, one can only hope it's going to be fun. I mean, there's going to be food, there will be games. It'll be fun. Last year, I came as a uh, a pig butcher. It was a lot of fun. So definitely come to this thing. It is a blast. And dress up. And dress up. Definitely dress up. I mean, it is the season to dress up. If you're just going there to dress up, thinking it's going to be one of y'all's wild college parties, you are wrong. We are only here at Brando's Brain Drain. We're only here for wholesome fun and void. (laughs) Only wholesome fun here. Treat it like one of your Japanese animus and dress up like your favorite scary, spooky character. I do love my Chinese cartoons quite a bit. <laughs> Chinese cartoons are my favorite. Those are the best, truly. Honestly, I enjoy my Korean flipbook art. I actually prefer a Plastic Hungry Jack's toys when I want to have a good time. <laughs> they're, they're always a trip. I'm always a trip. Sometimes I throw them in a the fire, and uh, it's always nice with the bonfire. I mean, things get a little weird after that, but um, you know, we don't talk about that. We're all we're only wholesome here, we're wholesome here. But anyways, Halloween parties definitely, definitely dress up. If you want to look for the pig butcher, look for a pig butcher. Uh, keep on the lookout for Shaggy and or Emo Freddy because he will be there making his uh long-awaited return over at the Halloween party. Like zoinks. <laughs> Roro Waggy? Yeah, if one of our loyal fans, all two of you, maybe three of you now. I mean, I'll never know. And if you want to or go one. as Scooby, that'd be awesome. Be cool. I'll go as Velma. You make a great Velma Raptor. I, I would say. make the most beautiful Velma. Jankies. Honestly. Jankies. 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 You can't say it, Walrus. Come on. It. Like you could say it. Jinkies. Speaking of it, if any of, um, so I've heard the new It movie has been very good, even though I'm probably a little late to this party. Have any of you seen it? Yeah. I have seen It. I have also read the books, and I have watched the TV movie, so I am all there when it comes to It. You're on it. 
I'm on you it. You are on it. I am on it. Tell me, um, if you had to compare the original with Tim Curry to the new remake, uh, which one would you uh, say would be better and why? I would probably say that the new one is overall better quality, but no one can ever compare to Tim Curry. Like, that's just not something you can do. You can't compare to the literal god of everything, Tim Curry. <sighs> now... I would often uh, refer to Tim Curry as the man who uh, looks a little bit too good in laundry. I feel like it should be illegal for a man to look that good. Oh, truly. Rocky Horror Picture Show, as much as Tim Curry does not like to talk about that role and pretty much de as, you know, essentially denounced it, it still was one of his defining roles. And that is an unfortunate reality for Tim Curry, but a very beautiful, sweet reality for the rest of us. I see you shiver with anticipation. Patient. <laughs> uh, can we get a soundbite of that? I think we're going to be playing the Rocky Horror soundtrack for the rest of the show. Oh, yeah, good. It's good stuff. Yes. It's uh creepiest show tunes you will ever see. And if you haven't seen Rocky Horror, well, uh, sorry for your loss. And I really think that you should uh, skip your class right now, go to your car, walk home, fly home, what have you, and go watch Rocky Horror. You have the internet. It's everywhere. If you like true spectacles... Every, uh, I don't know if it's the first or last Saturday of every month, uh, the theater, Cedar Lee Theaters, has a midnight showing of Rocky Horror Picture Show, and it is truly wonderful because they act it out in accordance to the actual show. It's they have actors playing with the characters on the movie and the screen. Yeah, it's every first Saturday of the month, Cedar Lee, uh, dress in drag, and you will get a discount there. Very uh, audience interactive, too. Um, I will not spoil anything, but um, you go there for your first time, they will pick on you. Just remember that. Oh, yes. It, it is a glorious time. It is a trip, and I would encourage everyone to go. Fans, non-fans, people who have never heard of it, all of you are welcome. Please come. It is... Um, it is a place where all truly are welcome, freaks and regular people alike. We're all a big, happy, disgusting family there. <laughs> all surrounded by the void. 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 Okay. Void. Void. Okay, void. how many how many voids was that? That was at least five more, right? At least five more. Okay, we're just going to put another five, which leaves us which leads us to let's see, we got three, we got two. So that's ten, twenty, thirty. Thirty five? So we are at 200 and, yeah, I can't do math, uh, 257. Yep. So got, void, void, void. Oh, God, goodness. Flat 260. 260, it's good. We still got another 100 left. I mean, if we don't go to our quotas today, that is perfectly okay. We're going to hit it. Uh, we're gonna, oh, we're going to hit it. We're going to hit that right out of the park. Right out of the just like void Tim, park. Just like Tim Curry. Just like Tim Curry. I don't care. The man is still, he's a good looking man, even if he is in a wheelchair. Truly, it is sad when I see him. I just want him to be happy and young forever. If <sighs> anyone, he deserves it. That's what I see. That's part of the reason we're getting robot parts, because we want to email them to Tim Curry so we can once again walk. You know how they talk about Mecha Hitler? We're creating Mecha Tim Curry. I don't know if we can talk about that on the radio. Oh. No. We, well. We're just gonna send that thought to the void. <laughs> Two sixty one. It was a. It was in a video game. We didn't. I, we didn't endorse the we, jackass. So. We didn't endorse him. Yeah. Hey, we. It was in a video Hitler game. sucks. He does. He this does. is a fact. Like y you shoot Mecha Hitler with. Mecha Tim Curry is better forever. Laser guns or something. Uh, Mecha know. Tim Curry is going to make the world a very, very giddy and very fruity place, and I will <laughs> welcome that world when it comes there. That's why we need these robot parts. We are not the ones taking over the world. It's Mecha Tim Curry. <laughs> yep. By the powers of the Void Gods. By the powers of the Void. 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 <laughs> Dang, that was like... That's another five. <laughs> no, that was six right there. Six. We are on a roll today. Definitely here at Brando's Void Hour. Or Brando's Brain Drain. But I mean, it really... We really don't have it, any kind of a structure here. Brando's brain, brain void. It, it morphed into the, yeah, brain void that works. Brain void. I do, <laughs> I, I do enjoy that. 
Oh, yeah. So, you need a whole new uh, paper for it. Yeah, nice. I mean, we're already... But, I mean, I'm writing these really, really big, and it's probably stupid of me to do that, but what are you going to do? Write them smaller, I guess? I mean, that would be the optimal path to take, but here at Brando's Void Hour, we do not take the optimal path, only the one that the Void dictates. Truly, truly. Truly, indeed. So, speaking of Halloween... Yes, back to our original topic of spooky season, what have you, Raptor? I want... I can't wait for uh, Stranger Things to come out. Like, literally, I'm not planning to do anything this Halloween but buy a buttload of candy, a buttload of soda, and watching movies, maybe with my friends. That could be fun. That does sound fun. I know, like, what was it, six years ago? Wow, has it been six years? We're going to watch Evil Dead 2, right? Oh, yeah, we're going to watch <laughs> Evil Dead 2 and Evil Dead 3. That's a staple. Come on. You know what? I've actually never seen the Evil Dead films. Oh, man. Yeah. We're going to have to make you watch them with us. You have seen Rocky Horror, but you haven't seen Evil Dead. I had uh, the... Uh, the guys here are giving me some really dirty looks. I feel like I'm about to get my ass beat. So uh, I think we're going to take a small... Okay, guys, put those chairs down. We don't need those. <laughs> put those chairs down. We don't need this.
Thank you, Lord Brender, for that wonderful sing-along. Who is Lord Brender? I thought it was Brando. Oh, yeah. Brando, Brander. Brand new Brando. You know what? Welcome back to the Brain Drain Hour. Um, um, it's back to be in the drain. Back to be in the drain, back in the void oh, again. something funny happening with this mic. Remove just once. Just once. Just once. Just once. So, uh... And I'm going to say void. Again. But not just once void. Okay, that's... <laughs> Dang, we are we have a lot going on, Void. So that's thirty. Uh got thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. We are at two hundred and eighty two voids, two hundred and eighty three. Void, void, void. Two eighty six. Two eighty six. Void two eighty seven. Void. Two eighty eight. <laughs> two ninety. Two ninety. Void. Void. Two ninety two. Two ninety two. Void, 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 void. Okay, we're at three. We are at three hundred voids. Oh boy! One. That that it, moment got ruined and sent to the void. We are on the home stretch, my dudes. We need. We have quotas to fill. We got sixty-five more voids to fill. Sixty-four more voids. Sixty-three. Oh, <laughs> no, it's uh sixty-one. Also, this pen You're sixty-one. Whoever buy, or at least you look like it, uh, oh. Wallace. On the subject of pens, um, if any of you want to donate robot parts. We also need pens, so uh, donations oh, are always yeah. accepted. Robot pens, thank you. Robot pens. But I think we... Also real ink pens. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm getting a phone call from the void. I will be right back. Is this our interview? Or no? No, that's next week. Oh, keep going. Oh. Yeah, so... <laughs> <laughs> I was completely... Uh, oh, so, uh, yes, how about that Halloween? It is a great time of year. The I'm, best. Yeah! I know if I'm excited for anything, it's always for a little bit of that uh, pumpkin spice, you know? Watch out, that's my stuff. And we have returned from the void, and I have dragged another Denison out with us. What's up, sweetheart? State your business here. How'd you find our dimension? How did you find your way into the void? Which void did you come from? Um, I was literally just dragged in here. <laughs> so he came from the, uh... It was the, the, the void from the outside, it seems. That's, uh, the kidnapping void? The, the outer void. The, the outer rim of the void that we're in right now. Jesus, how, you know, how, how, how many <laughs> voids are we gonna get? We got plenty now. There had to have been 12 right there, you know? Like, 13 voids, 14 voids. 15. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. You got 92 voids. 93 voids! Good lord. We are on a roll today. So on 93, we are up to a grand total of... I'm bad... Okay. I'm bad at math. That so. would be 313. Three, so we are at... 313 right there. We still got another uh, void, void. Void, void. So we are at... Void, void, we are void, at void, void. Okay, you know, one at a time, guys. You know, we can't... We have <laughs> quotas to fill here. I understand. Okay, so how many was that? Well, Look that at was us. four. It was another five or something. A void, he now it's three five. three and I did four. That's seven. Seven? Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. We are at 322. We are on a roll. So, uh, state your business here, stranger. Who are you? I was literally just dragged in here. Okay, I'm going to stop doing that voice. <laughs> <laughs> You're on Brando's brain drain. Uh, there is no such thing as total nonsense here. State your business. Are you sure about that? Okay, enough of that now. <laughs> <laughs> enough of that. We we got standards here. Okay. Yeah, you can do voices like this, but you can't do a voice like that, yeah? State your business, stranger. <laughs> I, I, I don't even know what to say, to tell you the where, truth. Where are you from? Where are you from? Cleveland! Oh, man. Cleveland's a nice city. It really is, yeah. honestly. We got a river that catches on fire. We got the Rock Hall. We got some good food here, a good music scene. Not only that, but Playhouse Square is absolutely fantastic. I yes. wholeheartedly agree with that sentiment there, right? Definitely. Rapper. Yep. And part of the best part of Cleveland is the museums, if we want to get honest right here. Like... The museum's playhouse, they got Severance Hall. I've literally sang on Severance Hall stage, and it's so beautiful. 
They have a Jazz Age exhibit going on. I believe it's at the Cleveland Art Museum. Ooh. Ooh. Very, very interesting stuff. They're all 1920s uh, artifacts you would find in that era. I would uh, recommend everyone to go check it out, myself oh, included. Oh, Chris, drive me there and pay for me, please. I want to go I see that. Have Take me. Money. So, uh, Stranger, I heard you also DJ a show here at Lakeland Community College. Yes, I do. At K B at 3. Nice. K and B at three. Mm, not bad. But there's no B today. Only, yeah, no only B vo- today. So we're just gonna take it easy. Only void. Only, <laughs> yeah, only B void. B is in the the meeting void. 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 Uh, void. Oh, there's two voids right there. Because we're like five or six. There, there was too many here. I mean, we have quotas to fill. I mean, I'm kind of repeating myself here. So. Uh, Kyle, how do you feel about Halloween? How do you feel that spooky seasons come around with this crazy ass weather going on? Honestly, I'm really excited about it. Like I heard you guys playing Marilyn Manson not even a few minutes ago, and I was <laughs> like, yeah. I mean, what else to get into the spooky season? What else to kick it off? I mean, how? Uh, Hocus pocus. Well, I actually have a so, really good song. Whenever you want to play it, we will be later. taking a musical break before uh, we fill our void quotas today. So, like all Halloween episodes for the rest of the semester, basically, uh, we're all going to. Ha- it's going to be a Halloweenathon here at yes. Brando's Brain Drain. And next time, we're hopefully going to have topics that we actually planned out because well, clearly, next time we'll have a visitor. <laughs> no, we already did have a visitor this time. No, a, a serious visitor. Uh, it seems like we have another visitor here at Brando's Brain Drain, and she has disappeared once more. You know, I feel like there's a ghost haunting us, and she's <laughs> back. There's like a ghost here. I'm not sure what's going on here at the Brain Drain, and somebody has let the ghost into up, the place, and she just called us nerds. Well, Uh, it's no longer Brando's Brain Drain, this is Brando's Spooky Hour. Welcome one, welcome all. Welcome Chucky. Oh no. <laughs> I, I don't trust dolls, dude, especially that dude. He, he's no good. I don't trust him. <laughs> Something about those eyes and them. I, would, I wouldn't doll be legs. trusting that either, like, especially how he looked in the movie. That's just creepy. Creepers, creepers. S- state your business here, ghost. What has brought you to this plane of existence? <laughs> what has brought you here? We are waiting for an answer. It seems that the Ouija board is not working very well. Revenge. Uh, Revenge. Revenge for what? You. Taking over my radio time. Uh, Taking over (laughs) your radio time. Are you the former ghost of Brando that has passed on from years past? You sound awfully feminine for Brando. You you would think, (laughs) but... Uh, Are you the woman who I was in a previous life coming to haunt me? And remind me where my place is in this world. I'm the woman you wish you could be. I mean, there, there are a lot of women I wish I can be, but uh, I'm not sure if my past life would be one of them. It's, it's like that movie, uh, Ghost of Girlfriend's Past. I'm, uh, what? I'm the poltergeist. I'm just the embodiment of what you want to be. Down, cowing to the light. It's a trap. It, it seems like it's a definite trap. Maybe it's a void, too. Void, void, void. The void trap? Yes, indeed. Trapped in the void. Okay, how many voids is that now? No one, no one say that word. We're going to count up one more time here. I got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 113. Bringing us to a grand total of... Void, void. Void. 135 now. A lot. A lot. That, that's too many. Wait. 30 more. 30 more. All right. Got to make 30 more. Void, void, and void, void, more. void. Void, void, void. Void, void. That's 10 right there. We're on a roll right now. Uh. Ghost, you want to help us out some? Say the words, ghost lady. Void. We got one we got one void from the ghost. One for me. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, uh, we are almost there. We are almost filling up our quotas. Seems more null than void. Okay, that was Whoa. pretty clever, but oh, you need to good. stop. <laughs> You're really... I can't say that on the radio. <laughs> he has no words. I have words that I'm I can't say on the radio. Let's see. We can't say... That's a void. We can't say... <laughs> <laughs> uh, son of a... <laughs> as in P... <laughs> 
As in. <laughs> Uh, I just looked in here at you like, what is he doing? In uh, there? There's uh, I ha- we um, uh, we are severely under budget here, and we do not have uh, methods to bleep out our very naughty words here. So I'm just going to use in my mouth instead. Hiring a scriptwriter too, please. We should hire a scriptwriter. Hey, ghost, you want to write our scripts? <laughs> what time period do you come from? I don't think ghosts from a previous life would use words like bruh. Bruh. It's the future. It's, it's oh. the, uh, the future. It's the dead it's memes. It's the future. Ghost. It's the dead memes ghost. The, the dead, the dead memes ghost. <laughs> Rest in pepperoni. Rest in pepperoni. Rest Zombie. in the void. I'm too ironic for you. She is too ironic. That's why she's ethereal right now. <laughs> what is your business here, ghost? Why? What revenge do you seek? I have to do things for children. Uh, that's oh. un- I, I'm very, very concerned for those children. I mean, I really think... Uh, I was just about to say. You gotta calm down a little bit there, unless um, there's one certain musician around here. Shout out to my boys in Crucigen! If Raddy heard this, uh, I love you. Oh my gosh. Please come back to me, I miss you. you. stop trying <laughs> to steal my boyfriend, please? Uh, <laughs> so wait. The guitarist for uh, uh, Crew For Real. Go check out Crucigen. And if you haven't yet, you're wrong. Also, um, it's- do or do not, there is no try. <laughs> uh, Raptor isn't wrong here, boys and girls. You heard it here there on Brando's no Void Hour. But there is void. But there uh, okay, is void. we're going to stop with the void. I stopped myself, it doesn't count. Do it half. Do it half. <laughs> okay, okay, we're going to do a little half slab right there. A little half right there. How many are we up to right now? Let's see. Ten. Is this our Beetlejuice? We got, we got 30. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Oh, God. It's showtime. Indeed, we got 30, 60, 90, 100, 110, 120, 130, 133 and a half. That's 353 and a half. Boy. You ain't scary. That makes it a hole. I'm not going to say anything. That makes it a hole. <laughs> now we just need ten me. more. Scared of the poltergeist. Oh. Void. No. Void. Wait. Void. 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 I feel like we are void. at our quotas, boys and girls. A round of applause for uh, 365 voids. We have met our goal for today. And we have very and much surpassed it. And with that... I think everyone's kind of getting aggravated with all this void going on, so we're going to go take another musical break. What do you guys think? I think the people outside want to put the volume down to mute, but they can't because they can't control it in here. That's why we only have two fans They're, here uh, on Brando's Brain Drain. Their volume control is in the void. <laughs> <laughs> Be gone, spirit!
We screwed up. Next song. Peoria, I think this is Lakeland Community College, and welcome to the Void Hour, is what I would have said 40 minutes ago <laughs> if we weren't on mute. Welcome to Technical Difficulties, a show. I'm your host, Brando. Void, 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 the void, void, void. void. Okay, show we're enough with the void. To the void. An entire show, if you really want to watch the, the stupidity <laughs> and the nonsense, you can catch us over on the live stream site. That's all I got. 
I'm yeah. actually kind of upset the we lost our entire break. show here. We dragged the guests in here and everything. We had a spirit. It was pretty dumb. It, yeah. it was baller. It was our best show. And it was, it was gone. great. It was all. It was that. That's the joke. Our best show lost to the void, and we're not counting that either <laughs> because uh, your host is a little too angry for this oh, yeah. crap right now. Yeah, this show is been it's now the void that this, this is, is no this show, it is just this, the void this show is just the embodiment it's of void literally that's literally we literally just cast you know our own voices no. into the void for yes. no one to hear well I mean, the and if that's us, not beautiful no poetic and artful i don't know what is actually you know what it's all those things but you know what else i think that is about both else? depressing Irritating. I think that's really, <laughs> yeah. really sad Depressing. because it feels like so, you know, it just feels like you know we're crying out for help and no one's there to listen. It sounds like we're all by myself. We're getting a lot of looks. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I'm having a feeling that um, all of our shows have probably been completely muted, and that's why we haven't gotten any looks. You know what? I uh, believe no, that. I believe sure that. I'm sure the other ones weren't, but maybe they were. Mabes, who knows? It didn't feels check, like it. So they could have been. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, There's Guys, man. the spirit's back. The spirit has returned with banana bread. Come on in here. Join the show. Join the fun. I'd love me some banana bread. Let's try some of that. Does it have any nuts in it? No. Okay, then I would gladly try. I'm uh, breaking of news. This is just them. Um, this banana bread is awesome. My past self, I was a woman in a previous life, and she has granted us the gift of banana bread, and it is fantastic. Uh, this is like right. literally round banana and literally bread. It is great. I want to everyone give a round of applause to the kind spirit bring us banana bread. Yeah, you the man. You the man. Only here, only here on the void. I've eaten. Kyle ate it. Thank you. Mmm. Now this is what I call. That's some good quality banana bread. This is fruity. <laughs> Bananas are a fruit. You're correct. This is a really good show where we eat on the air. <laughs> you know what? Don't they have entire like YouTube channels devoted to like? Cute girls eating huge amounts of food. I'm actually thinking about the guy who does food, re- like fast food reviews in a suit. I forget his name is, but I'm pretty <laughs> sure he's a vampire. He's he's a, he's a he's a total vampire. Never leaves his house. He's always wearing a suit. He's got this cold, dead look in his eyes. Same. Uh, I think uh, next week on the void, we're going to be pulling this man up because um now my neighbor. Uh, shout out to uh Kels if you're out there, thinking of you, dude. We got you, got you, Boone. Um. <laughs> We're going to find this guy, we're going to play him next week, and we're going to be reviewing his reviews. Imagine, like, reaction channels, but not completely devoid of talent. Devoid. There you go. We can say devoid all we want without tallying it. We can't. We're not tallying anything else because our tallies are out the window. That well, We are yeah, now... This show has been completely voided. <laughs> and we're not tallying that either. I just think no, that was a not. funny pun. Screw it. <laughs> what a disaster. But I gotta say... You bozos here, I wouldn't have it with no one else. Hey, I mean, if anything, we've enjoyed each other, and that is the best thing I could ever ask. I think that's pretty depressing. We didn't have a studio audience. So, uh, (laughs) you can get away from me from that meta. We have a visitor here on the void. Uh, how about you come around back and, uh, whatever. Okay, we just lost another fan, uh... Uh, we're, we're just scaring people off now, so I guess that's, uh, someone's actually hearing us here on the void. Whatever. It's, you know what? We have all this, we have all this spooky stuff planned here. All this spooky stuff, and, uh, literally no one to come visit us here, and it's, uh... Yo, maybe we should talk about the Halloween party again. Oh, yeah. Well, Lake, yeah, because that went to the void. Yeah, uh, Lakeland has a Halloween party. Be there or be nerd. Yeah, it's, it's uh, a it's, great um, party. October no, it really 26. is. They got food. It's wholesome fun. They have uh, bouncy castles. They have they bou- faces until, like, eight. Huh? Yeah, they paint faces until, like, eight, and I don't... It, it's great. I want to get my face painted, please. I, I want to go get mauled by a pig butcher when I'm there. Oh, yeah. Last year, I was a pig butcher, and I probably will be the same thing again. It'll be delicious. <laughs> bacon Riffic. Wowza. It seems that the spirit has returned and is, uh... I think she's leaving. I, uh, I'm not sure what's going on. What you got to say, spirit? Spirit of Halloween. 
Ooh. Our special guest. Ooh. Make that bother me. I'm just trying to eat my banana bread. Uh, you're <laughs> the one intruding upon our show, ancient one. Because you're a nerd. <sighs> this is only void here. There are no nerds. Just wanted to watch you be a nerd. Okay, that's a fair point. My past self always looking out for us here at the Void Hour. Uh, uh, before we sign off, uh, I just want to say robot parts. We need our robot parts, and we would greatly appreciate when you send us robot parts to create the quintessential Mecha Tim robot. Curry. Mecha Tim yes, Curry. Mecha Tim Curry. All right, you guys all missed that, didn't you? Oh, yeah. Dang, yeah, because the whole show has got lost to it's the all, Void. Yeah. Gosh darn so, it. Um, well, we just brought Becca Tim Curry from the void now. Yes, we did, and that's how we're going to take over well, the world. Speaking if, of Tim Curry, if a show here had to get lost to the void, it, it probably should have been this one. I guess so. I guess so. It's, this was kind of a this was, a this was a train. How wreck. many of you guys have ever seen Rocky Horror Picture Show? I Me. need to if see you it. You have it. You need to stop what you're doing right now. Even the spirit says it's good. <laughs> Even the spirit I need to see completely it. says exactly what we said like 30 minutes ago. Stop what you're doing right now. Skip your classes. Don't skip your classes. Please do not Please skip do not classes. skip your classes. Please you paid for them. Skip your classes. Radio and go see Rocky Horror Picture right Show. Right now. Right at, now. At Cedar Lee uh, last Saturday of every month or first Saturday. I forget. You said it before, but it I already forget. To be the first Please don't kill me for I've this then. The calendar... Because I've never seen it. Kyle, we're gonna have All right, to Kyle, you you're going to have to get out. Show. You're going to go back to the void where you They'll came have from. To take us both. <laughs> we're going to have to. That'll be fun. All right, boys. Oh, my. Get the chairs. We got some beat we got to do. Until next week, I'm Brando. <laughs> Sign it off. We'll see y'all nerds in the void. You're listening to 